Hey everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. Last week I did a video talking about uh, my will to create a spreadsheet of all the known batteries and the medical devices that they go to. Well, we are way closer to that goal. I have an actual product, a sheet I've been working all weekend and I've gotten so many data entries that I have hired people to help me organize the data into a spreadsheet. I had some people email me mass files of um, entries and I had to organize it and everything. But anyway, in the description below on this video, there is going to be a file that you can download and go ahead and check it out. So I have the manufacturer, I have the model of the equipment that it goes to along with how many batteries are required and, and some of them I have the type of battery that you're asking for and then I've got the voltage and the amp hours which are really the main tools I don't have any part numbers because part numbers are very subjective right so what I want you guys to do is if you're looking for a battery for a steris steris is the first column you can organize it by that the second column is 30 80 40 80 50 80 whatever and then you got the voltage and the amp hour so if you are looking for a battery, it's a very simple Google search. You just type in Steris and then 12 volt, 28 amp hour battery, bam, and you find it. So if you're looking for an Alaris, it's a Alaris, you know, uh, 8 volt, 2.4 amp hour battery or whatever it is. And hit enter in Google and you'll find your battery. It's that easy. The important part of the tool is the quantity required for that service like surgical tables often have two batteries inside them that is where this tool is going to help you quote out things a little bit easier a little bit quicker and if anything you might find some new sources for those batteries yes we at phobie we do sell a lot of those batteries but as i said in other videos right now logistics are being a little complex with batteries so there's lead time on many things but I figured I'd throw this tool out there anyway to help you guys with your PMs to help find these batteries and order them ahead of time. That's the key. Order your batteries ahead of time so that you know you have them for PMs. Trust me, I have like 95 surgical tables to do a PM on soon, like in the next month or two. And batteries right now are getting very difficult to find and definitely not for 95 surgical tables. But... Anyway, I've been working on quite a bit, guys, and um, I just wanted to share some of the stuff that I'm working on. That was the project. It went really well. I am not done. I'm still organizing data. People are still submitting via the form, and as I get those, I'll be updating the sheet, adding them to the sheet and stuff, so there's that. I also wanted to talk to you guys about some of my speaking engagements. I am going to be very busy coming up very soon. Um, it starts in just a couple weeks. I mean, I've got a board right here of all my different speaking engagements. I've got, um, geez, what do I have? It's going to start with MV Expo in Atlanta. I got Kansas City. I got Skytop, Pennsylvania. I got Dallas. Um, I got San Antonio. I've still got to go to Florida and North Carolina. And that's all in the next like month and a half, two months. Okay. So that's, uh, it's going to be really busy. So, guys, I'm going to try and release constant videos for you guys. Maybe these are going to be excellent opportunities for getting better videos. I have been so busy with my work here and uh, some of the stuff I've been working on. You'll know more about some of those projects very soon. But I just wanted to let you guys know if uh, I don't release much more medical equipment related material, it's because I'm working on a lot of other stuff, guys. So I'm going to be visiting new places. I'm going to be bringing crazy videos to you guys from some of the places I visit, some of the shows that we're going to see. And I'll probably be doing videos with some of the people I meet. There's some real cool people out there that I'd love to do videos with. So anyway, that's what's going on in a nutshell in the description below. I'm going to have the link for that file so you can download it and save it on your desktop. So if you have a medical device that's coming up for a PM, just look it up, find it, and uh, you can quote out your batteries probably way more accurately. Hope you enjoy. Thanks for watching, guys.